the purpose of the, uh, the video today is to really uh, update uh, the public on some of the things that the council is doing in relation to reducing its carbon footprint. As a kind of large employer uh, in the borough, it's important that we take the lead uh, on these matters. I'm just going to give you some examples of some of the things that we've been implementing. So, as you would expect, in terms of our buildings, we have a continued program of introducing solar panels, LED lighting, and improved building management systems to make our buildings energy efficient. We have a rolling program in terms of our fleet vehicles, looking to introduce the electric vehicles uh, throughout our fleet in order to reduce emissions. So as you might expect, uh, we continue to recycle the all that we can. And we'll be looking to um, reduce the use of single-use plastics, in fact, uh, eliminating them by 2025. When we purchase products, um, the green agenda is always uh, on our, on, in our thoughts. For example, consideration of where the products are coming from in order to reduce transport miles. The climate emergency will be integrated into all our induction training staff and elected members. To encourage our, our staff and members uh, to use active transport uh, as an employer, we have introduced initiatives such as the Cycle to Work Scheme, plus we've installed electric charging vehicles at the Civic Centre to encourage the use of electric vehicles. And in the last 12 months, due to COVID, obviously we've accelerated our investment in the use of technology, meaning many of our staff now work from home, thereby reducing the number of miles driven uh, and the emissions that they produce. This is just a few of the things that we've been doing and we're working towards, uh, that we're working towards, and there is much more. We'll continue to work with partners, businesses and residents in the borough and in South Ribble to share best practice and see how we can work together to help tackle climate change. Thank you. Goodbye.